The world of digital fabrication, 3D printings and digitally controlled milling machines is advancing fast, side by side to a growing use and abilities of CAD CAM tools. Into the potential of these technologies, we would like to reintroduce the values of a unique handcrafted artifact. We wish to harness the power of the virtual world when designing objects, while maintaining the unclonable authenticity of the craft process. The 3D is a handheld, digitally controlled milling device that preserves the craftsperson freedom to sculpture and to carve while using a computer to monitor and guide it. The computer will join in the action only when the milling bit is approaching the planned model. The rest of the time it allows complete freedom, letting the user to manipulate and shape the work in any creative way. The working environment has several parts, including a computer that runs the main control software and holds the 3D CAD model of the planned work. The magnetic tracker gives an accurate location and orientation in space. The tool contains a milling mechanism built on top of a long shaft connected to a DC motor. The shaft can be moved back and forth to achieve a linear control on the location of the milling beat. A PCB communicates with the main computer to determine both the shaft's movement and the spindle speed. A magnetic sensor is aligned with the shaft to track the exact location and orientation of the milling beat in real time. On the computer where the planned virtual model resides beforehand, the software is run in Grasshopper, a parametric plugin to Rhino. The software input is the tool's location and the outputs are commands to the PCB on the 3D tool. I'm very well familiar with creating CAD models, but I'm far from being able to sculpture complex forms using hand tools. The idea of the 3D is to allow people like me to engage with the material and create something that is one of a kind, unique. This allows me to be expressive and create an authentic piece, though it is based on a generic virtual model. Currently we are working on a new version of the 3D tool, improving accuracy and controlling abilities. Future implementation we envision is a 3D additive modeler, similar to a 3D printer. This is the start of a path that we hope will open a gate for a new type of interaction between humans and computers in the process of creating artifacts.